You know where you are. This is Nollywood Pictures too. and do whatever you want to do. But I'm telling you now, I, I, I never promised you marriage. All right? We're just friends and friends we shall be. But tell Matt, me that you me. never promised me marriage. I never promised you marriage. After all those years, after all those suitors that have been coming to me, that have been rejecting me, I've been with you, I've been beside you. You are now saying to me that you did not promise me marriage. Smart. You know, I thought you were smart because you had something upstairs. But obvious, you are dumb. There's nothing in that big head of yours. But you are mad. You are a big fool, you are an idiot! Wait, 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 wait. You are mad! Wait, 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 you are a fool! Hey, wait, 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 smart. Look, listen, listen, you're my man, man. You, do, you don't need to do this now, huh? Why are you making your Z on Majiro public video call? Bro, oh, if you don't want blood to flow, tell this girl to get the hell out of my house. Smart. Tell her now! Come down, okay? Can you imagine? Because of this fool, my fiance came to this house and she left! Now I don't even know where she is. Her numbers are not going. Why did you allow her sleep out in the first place? It's not because of her. She and Priska turned my house to a battlefield. Coincidentally, my girl came in here and saw them fighting, and she had to leave. Ask this girl, did I promise you marriage in any way? Did I propose to you? Ask your friend too. Ask him. If he did not promise me marriage, why would he take me around to his football games, to, to, to his club, everywhere he's going, he would take me with him. Okay. Why? Mm, gentlemen, lady. Um, you, don't, you don't have sense. No way! Why do you waste my time? No, it's, don't. it's okay, it's okay, listen. I think um, I prefer a solution to this situation. I beg you maintain peace, okay? Huh? Nonsense. It's okay. No, 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 don't tell me that. This boy this is a very wicked animal. He's very wicked. God will punish you. My God will punish you. You will never be happy in this life. You will never be happy too. If you want peace to win in this house, then tell this girl to leave this house now. Tell her to go. I need her out of my house now. Dima, 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 Toto, Dima, Fifi, Dima, Yasi. One name when he fell asleep, no be called to Kadim. Dima, Dima, Dima. Dima, 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 Tutu, Dima, Fifi, Dima, Yasi, One Nemo, Wenny. Ha ha ha. Oh, look at my sweet love. The love of my life. <laughs> oh. Uh -huh. You're my everything. <laughs> You're my sister. You're my mother. You're my confidant. You're my lover. The love of my life. I... My jewel of inestimable value. Oh. I love you. I love you too. <laughs> I wonder how my life would have been like without you. My love, I bless the day we found each other. My love, I have one prayer point every day. And what is it, my baby? I pray that, that our God should give us long life. Amen. And when that time comes that he wants us to come back home, that he should call us the same time. My love. The same day. My love, I pray he grants you that request. I know he will. Sure. <laughs> because he knows he created us to be like this. Hmm. <laughs> yes, he puts so much love in our hearts. I love you so much. I love you more than words can say. I love you more than life itself. Oh. <laughs> oh. What else can I ask her? 
Mama. Papa. Enough of this love. Please stop it, Ikechi. How can you tell us to stop loving ourselves? Stop it if you don't have anything to say, please. <laughs> Ikechi Wam. You see, this love was specially made up there in heaven. It just came and we are happy of it. Yes. There is really nothing we can do about it. <laughs> in fact, it is a follow come. <laughs> uh, stop, Papa. Uh, I'm saying that both of you are too old for love matters and you're there still kissing Mama's hand. Look, this love can never go old. It renews itself every day like fresh wine. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> and uh, if only it was possible to share in the love. Oh. I would have, but unfortunately, she's for me alone. <laughs> <laughs> The love of my life, I love you and I will always love you. Okay. Oh, my most precious jewel, I love you too. <laughs> mm. uh, uh, uh. What's this? <laughs> Come on. <laughs> oh. Victoria, were you not the one I asked to burn some hot water for me to take my bath with? Victoria? Excuse me, Dr. Wisdom. Please, let me just sound this as a warning to you. Stop ordering me around. Stop disturbing my peace. Victoria. I deserve as much rest. Victoria! Ah, oh, excuse me, Mr. Man, or whatever you call yourself. You heard me well. See? Both of us retired from the active service together, same time. So, I need rest. Ah, what's all this? Every time you be disturbing me, sending me around. You know, it's really a little thing. Don't you have legs and hands? Mom! Dad, what is it? Can't we have peace because of you guys? Shama, could you just imagine? Your so-called father asking me around as if I'm his well, common domestic home? Why would he be disturbing me, ordering me around every time? I need peace, please. Don't disturb me, Mr. Ma. Dad. No, no, Shoma, don't dad me. I don't need this pop in jail attitude. Now tell me, is it out of place for me to ask my wife for a simple errand? As a husband of the house, is that too much? But dad, you knew I was around. All you needed to have done was just to call me and tell me whatever errand you want to be run and it, you have it done. That's it. Please, Chum. Just one your father to desist from ordering me around. I deserve as much rest as he does. Hey? Excuse me? Oh, really? So we are now rubbing shoulders. You are done. the man and I am also the man. In the house? Is that it? Victoria. Dr. Wisdom, Mr. Wisdom, whatever you call yourself, let me just take this categorically. I want you to know that I believe in gender equality. Did you hear that one? Gender equality. We are equal. So are every other people. So don't, don't, don't just be ordering me around. Answer me this question. Would something happen to you if you had walked straight to the kitchen and poured yourself some water? Will it change you from being Mr. to Mrs. or from being a doctor to a Mr.? Will you have died? Will something wrong have happened to you? Please, Mr. Man, don't disturb me next time. Tell him. Let him not repeat it again. Mom! Victoria! Victoria! 
I just hope that this year feminist method of gender equality will be there to define the word husband when the time comes. Dad! The person you're talking to is already inside and yet you're still talking to her. Tell me, what do you want? I need some hot water to take my bath. Is that all? That's all. Consider it done. Now, can you stop? Doctors are in this way. Don't also underestimate the fact that I am a husband. I married a woman. Good morning, sir. Oh, smart. Sir, when did you come into town? I came in yesterday, but before I could uh, put myself together, it was late already. And I know your discipline about late visits, so I had to just uh, forget about coming yesterday. Oh, you have a nice intuitive spirit. You know my rules already. It shows yeah. that you make a good son-in-law. Ah, please sit down. Of course. Thank you, sir. Right. Of course, yes, I will make a good son-in-law. So, um, how are you enjoying enjoying your um, retirement? Ah, oh, well, uh, as you can see, uh, it's good to be home after thirty five years of enslavement in public service. I'm here now and I'm enjoying these little fruits. Yeah, I don't need to go to the market, to the labor <laughs> market, and get them. Yeah. And I'm studying rearing dogs and um, some chicks, you know, so uh, oh. I, I'm a handyman. Oh, I see, I see. You're doing very well, sir. I appreciate it. You're doing very well. I appreciate it. Uh, so, what can I offer you? Uh, good morning, ma'am. Good morning, ma'am. Um, Mr. Smart. Ma'am. Are you sure that I was supporting a marriage proposal to my daughter, Chun? Oh, hold on. Victoria, your narrative is a renos. As far as I'm concerned, Chioma is our daughter, not your Why daughter. Why are you okay, own. Mr. or Dr. Wisdom, whatever you call yourself? Hold it dear. Will you just shut, shut that thing you call your mouth? Let me just address this man's negligence of me. Of my person. Let me address him properly. Ma'am, um, I don't seem to understand what you're saying. I will just shut up. Or oh, do you prefer I send you out of our compound? Uh, uh, I'm so sorry, ma'am. I didn't mean to hurt your feelings. It's better you're sorry. Um, that's why I did well. While both of you were exchanging pleasantries, did you bother to ask after me? I, I was actually getting to that before you stepped in. You know, I... Shut! I said, shut, shut it! Hold it! Hold your stupid, senseless, and ignoramus defense, or I throw you out of our house. I'm sorry, ma'am. I'm so sorry. It's better. It's better you are sorry. Let me now make it clear to you, for you to know that in as much as Chioma belongs to my husband and I, so do this house belongs to both of us. We have equal rights. Oh, no, 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 that's there. You're getting it wrong, Victoria. We do not have equal rights here. Know your watermark and stand there. You are my wife. I am the man of the house. You are a housewife. You know? Yes, you no, 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 you are not the house. I am not the house. I have never you been a housewife. I will not be a housewife. I will not be a housewife. Yeah, I have not just had marriage and you cannot have this money with you. You cannot. Now, you what I tell you. This one don't pass it while I'm so good. I'll tell you. It's a double no case of it. If you know, get it. I know, go get it. This one don't pass it, trouble. <laughs> no, no, it's your, it's your, it's your bit. I take it now. Really? I've had so much now. <laughs> you put five bits in the pit. You want me to eat all of them? Oh, yeah, take this. My love, has it gotten to this? <laughs> it's your turn. Okay. On my honor, oh, you see. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> you see, for honoring me and showing me respect in life. Mm. Good things shall never leave you. Amen. 
Yes, joy will continue to be your portion. Amen. When you look left, help will come. Amen. When you look right, help will come. <laughs> <laughs> ah, my husband have taught the pastor because of love. <laughs> yes. Amen. <laughs> um, How come the meat? I'm eating. This one is sweeter. Uh, this, this one, this one is sweeter. I wanted to you give you spice. more. You put spice, more spice on this particular one you gave me. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> ah. My husband, mm. you will not kill me with jokes. Oh, mm? okay, okay, let me ask you. Did I magically put fresh spice na 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 on the one you just ate? I, I, I don't know. All I know is <coughs> love mm. is sweeter than wine. Mm. Yes. Love ah. is sweeter than wine. I love you. I love you for life. My king. <laughs> my prince. Mm. The love of my life. Mm -hmm. My very own one and only husband. You are my bread. Ah. I want to imagine that <laughs> you will now live now, my you will now walk away. Ah. My heart will stop. Go forbid. Go forbid. Walk to where? Ah. You go nowhere now. Ah. With Mama. Yes. Why have you maintained to this age the virtue of respecting and honoring Papa? As if it's your God. <laughs> and catch. Yes. You are right and very observant. But your father is my Lord. Even in the Bible, Sarah called Abraham Lord. And that same Bible instructed every woman to be submissive to their husbands. Hmm. That's good. And I am very happy to hear that too. Mm. Because I mean, the practice trend in our society now is gender equality. <laughs> and that is why there are so many cases of divorce these days. If you notice, plenty of homes are in serious chaos lately because of the same gender equality. But Mama, if I may ask, this your attitude of not taking meat while eating with Papa. Ah. Is it part of the respect? <laughs> yes, it's part of it. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. The Bible said that the man is the head of the family. So mm -hmm. I must be submissive to everything he says. Uh -huh. and, uh, and you don't expect me to rub shoulders with my husband. Uh, no, no, no. I won't do that. Never, never, <laughs> never. <laughs> Mama. Mm. Huh. Oh, in as much as I want to be very respectful to my husband, <laughs> I wouldn't want to be over submissive like you. The whole <laughs> humility is excess. <laughs> and I'm sorry, but it's turning to you. Finish this. <laughs> oh, God. Look, humility costs you nothing. Yes. And humility buys you everything. Mm -hmm. eh? Of course. Is it not better and foolish? Mm. And remain foolish uh -uh. and live with your father in peace. Rather than be wise and be at war with him every day, which one would you prefer? Which one would you prefer? <laughs> Please. <laughs> Humility costs nothing. Let me be foolish for your father. Biko. <laughs> Mama. And <Hey>, Kechi. <laughs> Go. Leave that one. <laughs> Forever lawyer. <laughs> You know, if I didn't apologize to your mother, she would have actually sent me out of this compound. <laughs> it was very funny. She's always like that, very stern. Are you serious? Always dragging gender equality with my father. Yeah, I, 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 they had a little argument, but <laughs> I'm glad your father knows how to follow her anyway. Eh? So, um, my love, when are you coming to the city to see me? I don't understand. When are you coming to the city so that we can finalize our marriage plans? Hmm? I know how to move ahead. Well, I don't actually know the date or what to tell you right now because I don't know how to convince my parents about that. Very simple. It's very simple. Look for something to tell them. Maybe you tell them you're going for to submit an assignment in school. Very simple. Huh? You maneuver these things. You, you know how to, to do, deal with your parents. Huh? Tell them something. Hmm? I'll see what I can do. Are you sure? Because I'll be waiting for you. I'll see what I can do. Ah, <laughs> it's all right. I trust you. I'll be waiting. All right. 
Meanwhile, I've got something for you. Inside the car. Really? Yes. Sit down, sit down. <laughs> Thank you. <Yeah. laughs> so how are you? I am fine. And you? How are you? You are not doing badly. So how is Dr. Wisdom and Lady, Lady Victoria? Everyone is fine. Trust me. <laughs> I like the way they are blending to the village lifestyle. Mm. It's not really easy to, to adapt. <laughs> yes, you can say that again. Mm -hmm. But <laughs> they were offered an opportunity for them to travel to America through a family friend. Guess what? They refused. You can say that again. Yes, I think they are beginning to enjoy the village life. That's thoughtful of them. <laughs> um, Chioma, my daughter, you know, um, uh, make yourself comfortable. Let me get some few things done inside. Mm. Mm? Mm, okay. I hope Unki is around, though. Uh, no, she stepped out with her mother to see a neighbor close by. Mm. So they'll be back soon. I okay. said, you, you want to wait for her? You want to go? No. I'll wait for her. I'm here. Mm -hmm. I would have said, is this not your ma our family friend? <laughs> it's okay. So make yourself comfortable, okay? Thank you. All right, then. <laughs> come Hey. What are you doing? You have to go out all the way to get this drink for me. Well, of course. Before I left for the drink, we both agreed that you are a family member. Yes. Yes, no? we did. Uh, but not to an extent for you to go and get drink for me now. Uh, uh. Sure, my daughter, you amuse me. Okay, if I was as rich as your father, that, that would have been understandable. That means I would have stored some drinks inside the freezer. All I needed to do was go there, get one. But since I'm not, I had to go get one for you. <laughs> Thank you so much. Please, it's out of the box. It's as if you're running errands for me. No, 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 no. Ubanu, drink your malt. Hmm? Don't attach any importance to it. It's just my humble nature, okay? Thank you. Drink and wait for your friend, huh? Enjoy yourself. Thank you. Yeah. Wait, hey, Oma, you make me laugh. Wait, you are shouting because my husband went to buy you malt. <laughs> oh, wait until see him prepare food for this family. <laughs> yeah? Eh? <laughs> Are you trying to say that Papa Kichi cooks? Cook? Cooking is the least thing he does in this house. I mean, my husband does house chores like eh? The father man is God sent. <laughs> you are really lucky to have such an honorable man as a husband. You can say that again. Udoka is such a peaceful man. He's loving. In fact, he's a father. He's everything to me. Hmm. <laughs> You know, I've been here for long. I mm. think I have to start going because I don't want to make or have issues with my parents. No problem. So please help me tell Nkechi that I can. All right. <laughs> <laughs> please say me well to your parents. I will. <laughs> All right, then. Okay. <laughs> bye. Yeah, bye. Hmm. Enki, hmm? your father hosted me today like a princess. <laughs> Imagine him going all the way out to get a drink for me. <laughs> hey, Choma. My dad can even do more. That one you saw, it's nothing. My dad is not an arrogant person at all. That's what your mother said. Yes, sir. Wow. That's so nice of him. At that age, he's that humble. Oh. May God lift you. Amen. 
You know, I believe that God has been favoring him through people's prayers. As a secretary in this community, he doesn't even allow that to get to his head. Wow. Nice work. Um, oh, my good friend. Smart came to see me. And he said he wants me to meet him up in the city. And how are you going to do that? Considering your parents and Tawala. That's why I came to see you. I need you to cover up for me. How would that be possible? You know what? I'm running out of time. Let's talk. Not good. I will be the one to drop you over and use the car for my crucial meeting. Dr. Wisdom, he seems to be forgetting something here. Generally, it is ladies first before gentlemen. And I always go where they come. After all, I contributed 75% of the purchase price. Oh, Victoria, I've seen how fast your oversight can elude you. When this car was purchased, was it not about the time our family friend Eko be traveled? And we agreed that we would assist him financially. Was it not our agreement that we split the responsibility initially? So what's this fog all about? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Were you forgotten? Thank God you reminded me of that. Come into it. Are you not lucky to have an enterprising wife like me that shares in your family responsibilities? You should take your God for that. Victoria, I must be frank with you. I would have preferred to marry an illiterate who would respect me as her husband rather than to marry a fishwife nagging type like you. Me? I would have preferred ah! to... Dr. Wisdom, have you seen it? That is the reason I always maintain that you are an ungrateful bitch. You're a bitch. Other men out there would have aspired to have me as their wife. But here you are running your maggot wife. You, you know your maggot mouth. Oh, but running my khaki. My special khaki with. Victoria, give me that khaki right now. Give me the khaki. I will not. Victoria, please. Don't come back here. Give me the khaki. Please, please. 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 Please,
Even as you are being proposed to Smart, don't allow him to intimidate you. Yes. Don't allow him to useless you because if you allow men, they will useless you. Always remember that you are equal with Smart. Men and women are equal. I've heard you, Mom. But could you at least live in peace with that? Even if it's for one day, for 24 hours, we could manage it, you know. Please, my daughter, do not allow any man to rubbish you or useless you. You hear about domestic violence here and there. Man killing his wife over film she excuses. Shioma, say no to that. Sue when possible, when necessary. Sue that person to court and prove your rights. Mother, please, can I go now? Yes, you can, but know the truth because it is only the truth that will set you free. Sue when necessary. Don't allow any man to intimidate you. Did you hear that? Shioma. Did you hear me? I should not allow you. Just look at it. Look at the car here. Had it been I allowed your father to intimidate me, he would have gone out with the car. But because I, Victoria, cannot be intimidated, and I know my right, I know that I have a poor right with my husband. That is the reason I was able to retain my key, and my car is here. No man will intimidate me. Oh my God. Yeah. There's something I want to tell you. What is it? There is American returning. And the guy has been disturbing me now. He said that he wants to marry me. Mm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, that's a good head start. So, um, what did you tell him? You know, I can't say anything to him. I have you. You're my baby, I have you, and I don't need any other man. Um, I just wanted to ask you, like, when are we going to get married? <coughs> mm. <coughs> um, well, um, thank you very much for that consideration, but I don't see us going any further than being just friends. Huh? Baby, what do you mean? What are you saying? Do you mean that um, I cannot be your wife? You cannot marry me after like six years of dating? No, that's not what I mean. I mean, I've never seen us in that light. I mean, walking down the aisle saying, yes, I do to you. <laughs> Come on. I think, I think we're better off as friends. Hmm? Stop saying these things. Look at me. So do you just see me as a friend and not to marry? Let's not argue about this thing. Okay? It's not in my power to decide if you're going to be my wife or not. Alright? Babe, we need this now. I need you now. I need you to tell me sweet things, appealing things, make me happy. I'll make you happy because I love you. Stop saying these things. Uh, hey, 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 babe. I think we should just enjoy the moment. All right? Flow with the tide. The time will tell. It's as simple as that. But this is the time now. There's no other time. This is the time now for us to do this. I love you, you know it. I love you so much. Okay, okay. Stop okay. saying these things, okay? I, it's, it's, it's okay. <laughs> it's okay, right? Yeah. Um, why don't we go to the other room and talk about this? Mm? Okay. Yeah, so get this settled, you know. Okay, go Yo to the room, mm -hmm. make ourselves happy, and I believe that good news will come up or you're going to change. Your I've mind is stop saying those things, right? Maybe. <laughs> I love you. I love you too. Let's All right, go. let's, let's, let's go. go.
Papa. Good afternoon, 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 Papa. Mama insisted on carrying the tools, irrespective of my agitations. She wanted to carry them. Why would you do that? What does that tell of you? Why would you allow her to suffer after so much labor, labor in, in, in the farm? And what does that tell of you? Does that tell of you as a well-trained lady? Don't you do that? Okay. Okay. Would it have been better that I pick a coil, Mama, when she insisted on carrying the tools? Next time, do not allow my wife to do extra labor other than the work in the farm. Is that clear? Crystal clear. Next time it won't happen again. And meanwhile, go right now and take the, 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 the tools from her. Okay, I'm going. Papa, I mean, my Go and get it from her. Don't, 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 don't get me angry. Okay, okay. Going. Going. You allow my beloved to, 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 to be carrying tools by herself. What kind of thing is that? You know what my life, I won't eat until you have eaten. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so big. <laughs> Man, this is too sweet though. My love, you are the world best husband mm. and father. You know, I don't know what I would have done without you. Honestly, Papa, my siblings and I are grateful to God for blessing us with a father like you. You're right. <laughs> and I just pray that God in his infinite mercy bless me with a husband like you. Amen. Amen, Mama. <laughs> Amen. Nikechi, my beautiful daughter. You see, before you wish for a man like me. Yes, Papa. You must be as humble as my beautiful wife. <laughs> as you see her, she's love personified. <clears throat> she's respect personified. <clears throat> and a, an embodiment of love and beauty. Hi. <laughs> my love, you have finished me. You see, the picture you just painted about me, it's just like I'm an angel in disguise. Mm. Mm -hmm. You see, what you don't know is that even the crayon that I'm using to paint, <laughs> I have not been able to see that particular crayon to ah. finish my painting about you. <laughs> you are the love of my life. Oh. I love you so much. And I love you more. Mm. I love you. <clears throat> mama. Someone is here. I'm still here, oh, Mama. Oh. oh. <laughs> Wait, oh. here. did I you just say someone is here? I didn't know. <laughs> I didn't know. I didn't know someone was. <laughs> Are you serious? Mama, did you didn't know I was here? <laughs> I didn't know you were still here. Okay, you didn't know. Mm -mm. <laughs> hey, what's up? Victoria, I need you to sign this check. Let me use the money I saw fit. And it's always them. I wonder why you always giving me problems. What do you want from me and why do you expect me to sign that check? Because I need it to solve family's issue. Dr. Wisdom, you seem to be forgetting something here. It is your responsibility to take care of this family, not with our joint account. So the only solution here is for you to go to your personal account and withdraw the money you need. Or you bring another check writing, adding the same amount that you need in equal proportion to mine. Uh, 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 Victoria, have you seen that this feminism has swept you into psychological malady? Why, why, why do you drive joy in rubbing shoulders with me? Can't you see the reason for the money? Dr. Wisdom, I don't want you to talk to me like that again, else I will sue you for domestic violence. Shama! You will all this in the Shama! And you know you will not go for it. Come! Come and listen to what the mother says! Just come! Calling her is not the solution. 
Would you kindly warn your mother to count aside this check? Let me use the money for your brother's taxes. Mom, sign it so he can meet up with my brother's request. Chima, will you just shut up and allow your father to dwell in his foolishness? I will not sign that check because he's not supposed to send money to your brother through a joint account. But joint accounts, hands have decided to withdraw their money to solve joint family responsibility. And Dr. Wisdom, I said no. I am not going to sign the check. What an arrogant mother do you have? Choma, do you know that this family is in jeopardy because of your mother's callousness? I forgot. She's your wife. You've been living with her all this while, so I'm sure you know how to do it. Oh, no, 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 no. That's where you're getting it wrong. We've been living apart. We only get the chance of coming together per annum during our annual leave. That's it. I still insist that you know how to go about it. You've been tolerating her all this while. She is your wife. All right. She is my wife. Well, just for your information, if I go in there, I'm going to try fist on your mother so she will understand that I'm a man of this house. That's, Nothing but that. That's a mistake. That'll be the grievous mistake that you're going to ever make. You don't hate women. Oh, but she seems to be my fellow man. Watch me. You should be very happy for the kind of parents that you have. Your parents are very influential, wealthy, and very rich. <laughs> I don't uh, understand. Uh, uh, uh. My sister. Mm? You are the one who is lucky. At least you have peace in your life and in your family. <laughs> My dear Choma, imagine you having all of your demands met. For me, <laughs> that's the opposite. My parents have to work, work really hard before they can even give me anything. <laughs> Why are still saying the same thing? Mm. Peace is paramount in life. Okay, you know what? Mm. Let's exchange. Come and have the money. Let me have the peace. <laughs> I need peace in my life. <laughs> you know, I think that's what we should do. <laughs> what is peace without money? It's just like a house abandoned by the owner for years. Of course, you know, the winds will grow. So, give me money and take peace. <laughs> you will not understand. <laughs> Calm down. You know that deep. Look at you now. See what I'm wearing. You know something different. Look at your hair. But me. Hmm. Both side. Nothing. Shingba. Hmm. <laughs> Gigi. Meanwhile, I'll be visiting Smart tomorrow. Hmm. That means I'll have to come tomorrow. Yes, like we planned initially. My beautiful ladies, you know during our time, our mothers taught us to see men as our alphas and omegas. Unfortunately, most of my men that succumb to that are no longer alive. They are dead. But Mama, can I ask you a question? If not, why not? Feel free. We are in an interactive section this moment, so yeah. you can say whatever you want to say. Thank you, Mama. Mama, is it wrong for a woman to be submissive to her husband? Thank you for that question. Because I have been asking my mom the same question all this while. <laughs> Tradition and custom, my foot. All men and women. Yes, Mama, you're very correct. And that's virtues 
of ours has actually kept our home in so much peace and happiness. We need this fool. If what I want to do now, eh? Jesus Christ, leave my clothes. Leave, leave, leave my clothes. Get out. What are you doing in this house? What are you doing in this house? You yourself. What are you doing here? What are you doing this here? This is my husband's house. My husband's to be house. This is my husband's to be house. What are you doing here? This is my What are you house. doing here? Let's go, let's go. Hey, 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 I want to kill you. Hey, babe, babe, leave me. What go. is this guy doing here? Let's go, of course. What's your problem? What do we know? This nonsense. What's this? Babe, so this is the idiot. This is the idiot that has been confusing you, my love. This thing. It's you that is an idiot for calling me names. Is he talking back at me? Believe. I don't even blame you. I don't blame you at all. I blame, I blame, I blame this thing that is here. That everything that you see is you enter. Well, it is shut blame. up. Shut up right now. So you don't have respect for my presence. Huh? What's the meaning of this? Respect. Respect for who? For me, of course. I should give you respect for cheating on me. I don't understand. How? No, no, no. I, I, I don't get it. No, che what are you talking? Cheating on you as what? As my lovely wedded wife or what? Is, is there something going on that I do not know about? No, 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 no you tell me. Claiming ownership of a man that she's just friend. I tell you, will you shut she your was... mouth? You see? You see? Will you shut up? Was I talking to you? You know what? I'm, I'm, I'm sick and tired of both of you. All right? I want you to out of my house now. Get out. I want you out of my house. You're asking me out of... What, 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 what do you mean by that? Get out. Get out of my house. Get out. Now. Get out. You, are you mad? Get out of my house before I do something very stupid. And you think I'm joking. It's not fair. It's not fair. Eh? Get out of my house. Get out of my house now. Get out. I'm not going anyway. Don't push me. Don't make me do something I regret all my life. Now get out of my house now. Get out! Smart, you can do your worst. See this place? I'm not leaving this position. What is this? Until you tell me that it's your doing this house. I'm not going no. anywhere. Huh? I'm not going anywhere. Do you get my brain English? What did you say? I'm not going nowhere. Sorry. I'm not going nowhere. No, 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 say that again! I said I'm not going nowhere, you hear me? Uh, that was what you said before. Say it again now. No, don't just, just try it! I'm going nowhere. Do it. 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 Well, let's say, give or take, tomorrow afternoon we'll be back, right? Yes, Mama. Uh, thank God you're into the system. Like I explained to you, we might get there and get to meet some tests and some quiz and all that. Yes. Some assignments. We have to stay put to work on them. It's okay, there is no problem. Just take care of yourselves. And don't forget to give me a call when you get there. Okay? And please, Mom, don't be too harsh on that. Ah. You tell your father as well. Just put a call across to him. Tell him not to disturb me. Eh? I mean, it does sound as if I'm the troublemaker in this house. The only problem we are having is that your father has been stubborn. He has refused to accept my philosophy of uh, uh, gender equality. That is the only problem Don't we're you, having. Mama, let's go. Because, Mama, later. Eh? Mama, later. Mama, take Bye. care. Eh? Bye. Take care. Respect is a reciprocal. Cause this time I run though, I bomba Please, bomba. I want you to have this 5,000 Naira. Please. If not for you, I wouldn't have made it to the city. I don't understand you, Chema. Are you indirectly paying me for helping you? I'm not paying you, but you know how much my parents gave me for this trip. They gave me a whole lot. So this is for yeah. you, this is your own. Thank mm. you for escorting me to the city. Hmm. Okay. I accept it. And thank you for your kind gesture. <laughs> You're welcome. Okay. Uh -huh. Remember to avoid any temptation from smarts. Make your no gasso. I don't understand. What don't you understand? Okay. In case he wants to, mm -hmm. please try to play smart. In fact, tell him that you're in your period. I'm in my period, of course. Oh, you're in your period? Yes. <laughs> Works like that because. 
I had no deal. You know, it's a secret. This thing. Be careful. I know. No <laughs> you know your parents. I know. Victory, you are very stupid to question my position as the head of the family. You see, this is a foolish pride. It will lead you to an irrecoverable fall very soon. Very, very soon you will see it. Dr. Wisdom, you are very senseless and stupid. What? Yes. Oh, you think I'll allow you to cage me like you did to your late wife? Never. Not this time, not tomorrow, never ever. It's not gonna happen. I regret why we crossed path in the first place. Look at you talking about gender equality, yet you allowed my daughter to go back to school without my prior notice. I am her father, yet I was not notified about her departure. Are you not an idiot for doing that? <laughs> Dr. Wisdom, you are the idiot. Just tell me. No, no, no. Give me one reason why you would not, as in, regret marrying me. Give me one reason. I know what you know. So, there is no way you are going to frustrate or cheat me. It will never happen. You are not going to cage me. I found out the reason why your late wife died. It was because she was an illiterate. She allowed you to frustrate her because she doesn't know her right. It's not going to happen to me, Victoria. Never, ever. Mm. Her Imperial Majesty Victoria. Oh, help me, please. She who must be obeyed. Yeah. Now you think you have arrived, and then you are now an indispensable soul. Let me tell you something. You see, this is your foolish pride. It will soon take you to a deep blue sea, and you will sink like the Titanic ship. Very soon, you will see it. Dr. Wisdom, go to the car and sit your dairy axe in there. That's the best place for you. Huh. Did I hear you threaten me? Mind you, next time you threaten me like that, I'm gonna see you to court. I'm not threatening. I know! I'm not threatening. Heaven must not wait. Sue me! That's what you are good at! Always going to cut! Very soon, I will go to that court to fight for divorce before you know it. Shameless animal. An Excalibur. The Wanton Demon. Go to Give me my own Why were you not a lawyer? Every little thing you are going to cut. See me in court. That's your mantra. You give me Yet you cannot life. perform your duty you your as a wife. That's who you are. You are a scallywag, a demanding one to go. That's who you are, Victoria. Send me to come. Thank you so much. Uh -huh. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Love of my life, I always do anything. Thank you. And it's not all the time you'll be doing this smile, because this smile you give me, it makes my hand look <laughs> yum yum. How will I stop? <laughs> Oh, my nice story. 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 Oh, you see this, my darling husband. Mm -hmm. I will not even trade him for the most expensive gold. Hey. <laughs> so please, I will not sit down here and watch you lay claims on him. Hey. Mama, but we're talking about my own father, my papa. And we are talking about my own darling husband. Mm. <laughs> Look, when you get married, you can give your husband as many pet names as you want. But you see this, my husband, is mine and mine alone. Oh, wow. <laughs> I can see that. Nkechi. Papa. You see this beautiful woman here? Mm. You see this bundle of joy here? Mm -hmm. <laughs> she is 100% right. See, even the pussycat made a parable with itself. He says, 
Do you know why I always cover my feces? Mm -mm. It is because I don't want somebody's thing to become another person's thing. Did so. you hear that? <laughs> I heard Did that. Did you hear that? Crystal clear. Mm -hmm. I heard that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> hey, Mama. Mm -hmm. Hey, so what about Chioma? She's fine. In fact, she was very happy that I visited. And guess what? Chioma gave me 5,000 naira. Eh? 5,000 naira? Ha! 5,000 naira, I'm telling you, Mama. Hmm. Hope you thanked her very well. Uh, of course now. She know my friend, because <laughs> I thanked her. Look, take money from there. Mm. Go to Daruza shop and buy your father a bottle of beer because he's been the one doing all the errands you're supposed to do. <laughs> ah, Mama, you're so impossible. You know what? I will not just buy Papa a bottle of beer. I will also buy you one because you, you, you two deserve it. <laughs> use that money you want to use for me to buy your father two bottles of beer. Mm. Okay. You want me to get drunk? As you wish. <laughs> Hey, it's alright. I love it. Let me go and drop my bag. <laughs> you know that's when our love is sweeter. Yeah. You know now. Uh -huh. You know now. Uh -huh. <laughs> ah. Yeah. Oh, Ketchi, come back. Dad, it's all for one and it's not and shameful. But you and mom are the ones frustrating my education. That is not nice. Uh, son. I am sorry for all the pains we have made you go through in school and not been able to meet up the financial requirements of your school. It's not I to blame. It's your mother here. How did I come into this now? David, you better warn your father not to mention my name again because I've already seen his plan, Jamie, to knock hers together. What gimmick are you talking about, Victoria? Did I not come to your presence and mellowed my personage like those in grottoes, saying prayers, asking that you can't assign the check. Let me withdraw the money and make it available for David for his tests. What did you do? Like a Samian missus, you blatantly refused. Don't insult me. Don't call me names. Mind the words you chose. And did I not also ask you to add my own share to the check? Because it's a joint account. Oh yes, what did you do? You blatantly refused also. Mom, what are you saying? Did you just listen to yourself? That that should add the exact same amount I'm asking for, for you as well? Oh yes. Mom. Because it's your father's duty to train you, not ours, not mine. His personal duty. Does it make sense to you? Did you hear that? David, have you seen why we're always having this verbal field? So if I am to withdraw a hundred thousand naira for you, I will also make available a hundred thousand naira for her own yeah. personal use. Yeah. The question is why? Why? Mom, why are you doing this to me? Why do you want to ruin my future? Mom, come on, I'm your son. Dad, what is all this? I'm, I'm just tired. Dr. Whitton, you are trying very hard, very hard to force words out of my mouth. And if you don't take time, I am going to spill the beans. Spill the beans for all I care, Victoria! Why are you waiting as if there is thunder in the sky? I want you to spill the beans right now. Heaven must not wait until you spill the beans. Spill it! What beans are you talking about? That's what, what did you say? The only person that can introduce this bean we are talking about. Oh, Victoria, calm Spill down. the bean! Calm down. <laughs> the devil is such a... <laughs> Marzia, look at my friend. <laughs> um, what do I owe this August visit? Because you cannot be seeing Igu walking about the street here and there, here and there. So tell me, what brought you? Huh? Udoka, <laughs> Wokoma. <laughs> You know, the communities, everybody gathered hands together and gave you this title. Omudo Nkizizi, in this our community, as a peacemaker. And uh, by the grace of our ancestors, 
I have been trying. <laughs> Razi Maker, you're welcome. <laughs> Omudo, what brought me to your house? I came to report Aaron Ihedua to you. That man is looking for my trouble. Seriously. Aaron Ihedua. What, 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 what is it this time around? Is it, is it that thing? I thank our ancestors that you are the secretary of this community. Yes. And you were there the day our king want me and him not to enter into that uh, uh, disputed land. Yes, I, I, you cannot be telling me that I was the the secretary, like you know, and I took the minutes. Is it not the, 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 the council meeting, uh, meeting we had? As I'm talking to you now, Aaron and his wife, they are inside that land harvesting cassava. Is it I'll say this again. You are not serious. No, tell me, you are not serious. I'm very, very serious. I'm going to go on. I'm just giving you respect. I'm going to put you up. Smart! 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 You, you need to go back home. Those ladies are so in your house. We're about to tear themselves apart before I left. So you need to go and sort them out. <laughs> Listen, why don't we go home so okay? You and who? Go back where? Me and you. I don't want anybody to wipe my brain cold. Nobody's going to wipe your brain cold. Come on. What are you talking about? Let's, let's just go I back. said they were about to tear themselves apart. Haven't you been listening to me? Don't worry about that, okay? They're not going to tear you apart. It's their business. So let's just go back home and talk about this. You've not been listening to me. Babe. Babe. Please. Let's go home and talk about this. They, they, they're not my business. I don't give a give a fuck about them. That's what we need to hear. All right? Let's go home and talk about this. Please. You don't understand me. I said they were they were they were boxing the way. None of my business. Let's go home. All right? Sure babe, I should... babe, 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 please, 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 now. and wicked at the same time. I know I hurt you. Yes. Well, at least take your course to tell me where you are. What's all this? Did you actually walk into my compound to say Are you crazy? I'm sure my parents were around. Is this how you're going to be talking to me? I don't care. I don't bloody care. All right? Do you know what I passed through searching for you everywhere in the city? Do you? You're a very heartless man. You're the one who is wicked. Do you know what I went to come into the city to look for you? Do you? Listen, I'm sorry. Okay? I, I'm truly sorry. My old boss was as a result of my my anger. I'm, I I'm don't sorry. care. You are a beast and a devil in cunt. Now leave me out. Get out of my compound. Are you seriously asking me? Get out. Give me my own, I go give you your own. If you give me my right to you, I go give you your own. <laughs> 